Hello, hello everyone. This is Mr. Fox. Welcome to my den on another episode of Let's Play Lost in Random. Uh, now, last time when we left off, we uh, reached here, quote unquote. <laughs> and I guess we'll need to uh, see where here is. Ethan had a feeling, call it a hint, that her new friend Dicey would be able to open that door for her. All it would take would be a roll, or two. Roll for initiative! just going to say that <laughs> I was just going to say that I actually don't know if there were story pages or cars in two town in uh, the previous area the in between or something but what did it want Okay. No. Oh. Did you hear? The new moon is finished. It is wonderful to finally look up at the sky at night and see two perfect moons. Oh, indeed. You sound like a vampire, sir. When it comes to the new moon, I am of two minds. And they both love it. Okay. We're all number one at being number two. <laughs> uh. Two-way oh, street. Of I get is, Good morning, is world! It's a beautiful day! My favorite kind! Any second now. Oh, curse it too. <sighs> Though I suppose you can't have the sweet without the sour. Attention to town. Now hear this. The queen is wrong. Or two. The queen is wrong. Or two. Her will is now manifest. Long may she reign. Random rules. Oh, a two. What a delightful. <laughs> Way to make a perfectly awful day even worse. <sighs> Another dreary day, everyone. Just muddle through this horrid life until death finally claims us. Oh man, that was so sad. The queen. She went the menace. Okay. The cool queen rigged to roll a two, and now from everyone from being happy and joyful, they started being all like, oh man, I'm so depressed. 
nothing matters and all that. Two way street, cellar street, two town square, square, square. Oh, well, as long as long as you're not attacking us, I you don't belong here. Maybe you don't belong here, fish face. What's with the thingies dangling from your face? You don't belong here. You already said that. Oi! Oh, what are you looking at? You heard me. Something. We've got enough problems here without <coughs> strange weirdos wandering around town. There's nothing wrong Just with Just keep telling yourself that, kid. And while you're at it, tell yourself that you're not missing anything by having just one personality. I seen you when the dice got rolled. You didn't change a bit. That tells us you're not from Two Town. I reckon you're a wanna, and you don't belong here. You don't belong here. Where are we? It seemed to even that there were two sides to every story, especially here in Two Town, where even the residents seemed to be of two minds. We must explore the premises, of course, and get our bearings straight. Did not even. Oh, that's good to know. <laughs> Very cute. Hmm. This goes here. So we're gonna walk the other way. Who is it? I had like two achievements. For free. The past few minutes. I was not leaving this place properly explored. Yoink. I want to meet that uh, many something face. To spend my coins. Oh, oh wait! Oh, I've got cards to trade. Cards, cards. I got cards here. The greatest cards in the land. From my body to your hands. And speak of the devil. <laughs> I did not expect this guy to be many decks. Wait, is your body a store? Yes! But was I born with a store for a body? Or did I somehow force my body to become a store? Well, you'll never know, because you'll become instantly distracted by all of the fantastic cards I have to sale. <laughs> oh, I can tell you've got an eye for cards. Always terrific to meet another card of saw. <laughs> Many decks at your service. Ardeser. Yes, of course. It's a combination of card plus connoisseur. It's a portmanteau, you see, which I guess is itself a combination of ports and mantos. Whatever those are. <laughs> Now listen, since you're a fellow card of sewer, and since business is slow, I'm gonna do you a solid, mate. Old Manidex is gonna give you a lovely binder to hold your cards in. On oh. the house. Thank we'll you. just need to teach you how to use it. Card binder. Your personal card binder uses it regularly to modify your deck and try out new combinations. I have access to the card binder, press to open it hmm. card binder. this is the card binder uh, here you can inspect and edit your deck of cards uh, hovering over a card is a 
in either your deck or inventor will generate a card description consisting of the following elements title effect description and card type five card types weapon damage defense hazard cheat this is your inventory this is where the cards that are not current your deck are located Oh, so there are a total of 34 cards. Cool. This is your deck. Cards you bring into the battle are listed here. If the deck has less than 15 cards, it's automatically filled with cards from your inventory. Right now, you own less than 15 cards. But once you have 16 or more, you can start customizing your deck in any way you see fit when you are ready press the button again to exit the card binder well isn't that cute yeah so these are the one two three four five six cards that we already have and oof, there seem to be a lot of interesting cards it's like boss like cards okay now then what with that shiny new binder with all those blank <clears throat> pages in it you're probably in the market for some new cards eh yes of well, course good news it just so happens i've got the greatest cards in the land from my body to your hands ha <laughs> and at the best prices too Where do you get your cards? Where do I? Oh, mate, if I tell you my sources, what's to stop you from turning your body into a store and setting up a competing shop, eh? <laughs> I asked yep. you. Truth be told, it was always my dream to um, turn my body into a shop for cards. Isn't it everyone's dream to do that? An interest that will soon wane the more you study my glorious body. I'm afraid I can't tell you the provenance of my cards. Just that they're an amazing deal. Best in random, only in random. Just to study my amazing body. <laughs> Is everyone in your family um store? Is everyone in my family a store, you ask? That's what I Honestly, ask. Honestly, I think the answer to that is pretty obvious. <laughs> um. No? No, you don't think the answer to that question is pretty obvious? Well then, we'll just have to agree to differ. <laughs> I'm gonna ask you again. Is everyone in my family a store, you ask? Honestly. I think the answer to that is pretty obvious. <laughs> this guy really reminds me of the uh, storekeeper from Resident Evil 8, the fat guy. <laughs> Glad you agree. Then we both agree the answer to that question is pretty obvious. Smooth. Were you born like this, or is this a choice? <laughs> Mate, we're all born one way. And we all decide what we want to do with that. I was born with an interest in trading cards and decided to absolutely lean into my interest in trading cards. All the way, mate. <laughs> Woohoo! Ha <laughs> ha! No regrets! Shoot! Seriously, I have many questions about your body. How do you get in there? <laughs> Why? How did you get in yours? Is everyone oh, in my I, family sorry, a I, I really asked you ask? That. Honestly, I think the answer to that is pretty obvious. <laughs> Glad you agree. 
then we both agree the answer to that question is pretty obvious. Right, let's drop for cards. Oh, sorry. Welcome to the card store. There's not much to see here at the moment, so let's rectify that right away. Oh, what's this? Hazard, cheat, damage. Ooh, damage. Wonderful, these new unlocked cards are now available for purchase. For this one time offer of only one twenty. See that coin counter in to the right? Yep. Every coin spent at the store fills up the counter. When it's full, you'll get to choose a new pack of cards. To add to your assortment, the more cards you buy, the more cards will be made available. Oh. There's something special in store for the most loyal customer. Keep unlocking cards and find out. Interesting. <clears throat> now, we do have these already. Uma's Embrace. Summon the Witch of the Valley's Bubble Shield. Fully shields even for one hit. Mm. Time Trap. Summon clocks that slow down adversaries costs caught in the pocket of Dain's Mansion. Last 10 seconds. Oh. Hammer of Two. The spirit of Tuta manifests in the shape of a hammer. Press X to whack. Hold X for a spinning attack. Oh. Explosive dice. Dice he turns into a ticking bomb. He'll explode in 9 seconds. Don't worry. Unlike even Dice C will survive the explosion. Crystal Purse. When breaking crystals attached to an adversary, they also take damage. The crystal curse lasts 30 seconds. Mm. Chris, critical 20. Summons a demonic e Icosafedron. The damage is any being in its path and it bounces off anything it hits. It exists for 20 seconds. Blink attack. When even Blink dodges through her adversaries, they take damage. This effect last 30 seconds hmm. what well, we would like to get the time trap i don't see oh yeah that's us that's my money and the hammer of two and hmm The blink attack. Golden pin. Here's a gift for being such a loyal customer. A golden pin can be used in the dice mansion using save a card in your hand until the next time the dice is rolled. The more pins you have, the more cards you can save. Oh. Cheat cards. Each crystal is worth more increase. Each crystal is worth more increasing the speed of drawing cards lasts for sixty seconds. Blacksmith's blink. When performing a blink dodge, your weapon's durability does not deplete for a short period. Okay. I can get something of 160. I will get Uma's embrace. Thank you. Oi, oi, Maddie Dex here. Card in. Oh, 
Oi, oi, Matty Dex here, card enthusiast and living store at your service. Yes. Oh. This Even one. was beginning to learn a lot about this new part of random, but not, unfortunately, how to escape it. The door was locked. Perhaps someone nearby was in possession of a key. To be sweet. I don't know, someone like this guy? Have you seen the upside downtown? I'm building it. The, the flip city down. in the sky. You can't miss it. It's not just me, of course. Lots of construction jobs up there. That whole site was designed by Her Royal Highness, the Queen. It's the ultimate expression of two-town. <laughs> Name's Smokey, by the way. The bear? So there's two... two towns now? That's it. That's exactly it. Everything must have its other half. It's only natural. Some call the Upside Downtown a mere distraction. A minor obsession of the Queen designed simply to keep us all busy. You know what those people are called? Correct. Ha! Good one. No, they're traitors. Of they're course. obviously traitors. It's the ultimate expression of Two Town. What it was always meant to be. Two cities in one. I'm sorry, I I'm on break now, and Smokey only gets a little time for himself, don't he? So you'll have to excuse my rudeness, but I don't have much else to say. Oh, well, makes sense. It's okay, buddy. The fight was the Queen's royal robot guards. She had to think fast. She had to roll the dice. <laughs> She has the dice. So let's play the blink attack. Victory! So there was nothing there.
Or to get reinforcements. Damn it. Reward! Okay. Well, that was a more intense fight, if I do have to say so myself. Bronze ornamented creature whose sword its life to unlock one particular lock. Okay, so keys are living beings as well.
Hey, you. Come here, Utek. I don't trust you. Fine, let's see what you have to hey, say. You. Come here. Question's not who I am, lad. Who it's who you're with. That six-sided fella by your side. Tell me about him. There is a dog in the costume. No dog. I think you got one of them dice by your side. See, most people wouldn't recognize them no more. They've been extinct for so long. Banned by the Queen, and she's got a terrifying black one. The only one left in all the land. I wonder Ooh, why. So she thinks. I'm sure I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm sure you don't. Having a dice is treason, after all. Be careful out there, love. There might not be many of us left who know what you're up to. But you can't fool everyone all of the time. See you around, kid. So, it does speak. And with the ancient dice tongue. How intriguing. Oh, <laughs> feisty little friend. one, ain't ya? No need to fret in the curious. Do say I to the queen once she does find you. Hmm? <laughs> I don't know, Dicey. But I didn't like her one bit. Yep, me either. Yeah, this is where we need to go. I would like to know what's up there first. There. What? Bridger! She went on and off. Hey! I knew this was important. Well, sort of important. A storybook page, an illustrated page from an old forbidden storybook. Collect and read them in Evans Binder. Uh, Evans Binder. Life was insane and beautiful. A glorious mess. Those who wielded dice would challenge each other in grand board game tournaments to win favor from the king or queen, or even just each other. The rules were wild and capricious, and the games even more so. <laughs> and everyone in random loved them, and the dice wielders themselves, with all their heart. Okay. I'm... Long lost or past, I would assume. Gotta say, the art style and the creatures, oh man, they look absolutely gorgeous. It's like some uh, sort of Tim Burton 
Alice Madness Returns vibe here. Loving it. Let's unlock the key. Oh, unlock the gate with the key. Let's see. Our oh, it's And you Sellers Street. Crispy twigs? Kids love crispy twigs. Crispy twigs. Ooh, there's a quite the area here. Okay. Yep. Hey, kid. I'm selling crispy twigs here. Crispy twigs to trade. I'm sure you do, buddy. Uh, but we'll check out what you have to sell or say. In the next episode, I'm wrapping this one right here. That's been great as always. This is Mr. Fox, thanking you again for joining another episode of Let's Try. Oh, let's try. Let's play. Let's be honest. Let's play some Lost in Random. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Any feedback from uh, you guys is greatly, greatly appreciated. Since I'm still starting out on this YouTube scene. And yes, with that being said, Mr. Fox is signing off. Thank you again for joining my den. And see you in the next one. Bye!